at the scene of what some people are calling the Boston Massacre. In this tragic day, Bostonians were throwing snowballs at the line of British soldiers when a flying snowball hit a British soldier in the head and he fell down. That's when the British retaliated. Here's Tom Cutler. Tom? Well, I was just uh, walking near the customs house when I saw some patriots throwing snowballs at, at the British soldiers. I didn't think much of it, because you know, it's kind of normal, but that was when I heard the gunshots. Well, what do you think? Massacre or self-defense? I don't think it's my place to decide. That's kind of for the courts. It was murder, I tell you! Murder! Sir, what are your views on today's event? I saw the whole thing. Blood was spilling everywhere. Smoke was in the air. Thousands of bullets shooting poor, innocent patriots. It was terrible. Murder, I tell you, murder! <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. How has this event today affected you? My husband, he's dead. How did this happen? Well, I don't think the British meant to, but he was in the massacre crowd and they shot him. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Are you aware of the tragic event that took place in this day? Well, yeah. Well, what is your opinion? I think it was totally self-defense. Because you know the Patriots were throwing chunks of ice at the British before they even retaliated. It was self-defense, I tell you. Self-defense! It's them! Everybody run! Excuse me, sir. What are your feelings on today's event? Those idiotic Patriots need to mind their own business, especially with British soldiers who have guns. I'm glad that guy threw that snowball at me in my head so I could accidentally kill him. If the British get in a war with these so-called colonists, we'll win by a landslide. Thank you for sharing. Now back to your regular scheduled program.